Alright guys, welcome back to the FIFA 22 Super John McGinn Ultimate Team Series where we go all the way from Division 10 up to Division 1. The last time we played this we were on a bit of a downer. We just lost the World Cup semi-final playoff match to Ukraine. Super John McGinn wasn't so super but tonight it was a nice win over Armenia. A 2-0 victory and John McGinn is back to being in the good books. And speaking of good books, we're in the good books because... We put together quite a lot of wins now. I actually cannot remember how many wins it is in a row, and that's a good sign because when you forget counting how many wins you've got in a row, that normally means you ain't losing. So we don't need to worry about being shite. We know we're good. We know that we are climbing these divisions. We're in Division 5. We want to go even higher. This is what our team looks like, but we still have one upgrade to bring in from the last episode, which I didn't get to make due to a coin financial situation. But we're all, we're all right now. We're covered. We've got like 66k in the bank. Now, 66 is a horrible number, but on the bright side, England will never win the World Cup again. So we only need to worry about the one 66. There'll be no other you know, double digits that we need to fear about. But yeah, this is the team. I am going to improve it. I'm thinking about bringing in Coutinho for Ryan Fraser since we took Coutinho out of the midfield. But yeah, Barry, Bannon and Caden don't really work with those dead links. So maybe... I will look to upgrade them once we get round to it. But we've still got four cards we need to upgrade. That is Martinez, Fraser, Watkins and Bailey. I think we're going to upgrade Martinez last because he's been good for us in nets since bringing them in. Plus he has the highest rate of the remaining uh, normal gold cards. So yeah, Martinez will stay for now and we are going to upgrade Ryan Fraser. So let's go and do it. Let's get into this transfer window and, and start buying. I mean, I mean, I did say I was going to take Coutinho, but if there is somebody better, I mean, if there's somebody that is a, more appealing than Coutinho, then I guess we'll take him. We've not committed ourselves to Coutinho. It's not a marriage. I mean, we're not married to the guy, but then they, but then they go down on one knee and say, Coutinho, will you, will you be my lawful wedded, you know, left wing? No, but then they do that. So if there is somebody better than Coutinho, by all means, we can maybe go for them. But I don't think there is. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure when you look at the Aston Villa attack, he's pretty much all they really have on the left wing in terms of, you know, in terms of special cards at least. Someone's got a John McGinn centre forward card that is interesting. Right, what we'll do is we will go to the minimum by now and we'll pump this up. Pump it up. Pump it up. To thirteen k, fifteen and a half k. I think fifteen and a half k works. Let's see then. Uh, there's Coutinho. Uh, could oh, holy sh... 1.7 million. Fuck me. 1.7 million? I was going to consider getting that one, but nah, man. We're going to have to stick to the uh, the bargain basement, Coutinho. Left wing. I can't... <laughs> where, am I, where am I supposed to get one point? Do you know how much money I need to spend on FIFA points to get... Well, you probably need to spend about two grand on FIFA points to get that amount in coins. Unbelievable. We'll give, we'll give that Coutinho a pass. That Coutinho is um, no coming into the squad, that's for sure. There is a special Bailey card, but I'm pretty sure Bailey's 82 rated anyway, so... What, what's so special about this fucking card? Uh, we've got Watkins who we could take. Now, this card looks really good. I'm not going to lie. That card looks absolutely spanking. I mean, look at it. 86 overall. Look at those stats. 86 shooting, 85 dribbling, 82 physical, and 92 pace. Plus, he's got a Hunter. That card is... That, I mean, that has a... <laughs> That's a tempting card, but I feel like, I don't know, I feel like I said I would take Coutinho, so I am tempted to take Coutinho, but we'll have a look, we'll see, is there anybody else? I think that's it, I think that's all that there is, so uh, let me go back to that walking cards, can we, like, add that to transfer targets? What the fuck, we can't, why not? Wait, hold on, add to transfer targets, boom, 45k, is that overpaying for that? Holy shit, it is overpaying for you can get this one for 34. Uh, yeah, I know this one's not got a Hunter on it, but screw the Hunter. 34k is cheaper than 45k, right? Well, we'll add that in. Let's look at Scottish attackers. Let's see if we can get any good Scottish attackers. Let's, nation. Oh, Flower of Scotland. Have you got any good left wing hangers? Have we? Let's find out. I tell you what, there must be left wingers in Scotland because nobody's right wing. I fucking guarantee you that. Political joke there in case you didn't get it. Oh, Johnny Russell. Big Johnny Russell, man. Right winger. It's not quite left wing, but it could do. I mean, Joe, uh, the only thing is chemistry, like, we would get absolutely fucked. <sighs> if, we take, if we take Russell, man, we're screwed on chem. It's a nice card. It is a nice card, but 
it would absolutely hamper us on the kit. Kenny Daglish. Tell you what, Kenny Daglish is an option. Only cost 106k. Uh, there's a Daryl Morgan card, but again, it would just the, the chemistry that we take, the hit on the chem just would not be worth it. Um, but that Russell card's pretty nice looking. It could be an option. Who's this Maguire guy play for Lincoln City? Nah, Ryan Hardy, he also plays for Lincoln City. Didn't even know that guy was Scottish, right? I think we're just going to have to go... When Scott got a team of the week? When? Since when? I think we're going to just have to go away. Coutinho left wing. But that Johnny Russell card is nice. It's very nice. But not nice enough for me to hamper the entire chemistry of the team. So I am going to go back and I am... We actually... You know what? I'm going, to take, I'm going to take that Watkins card. Fuck it. We're going to go with that Watkins card. Screw it. Yeah, why not? It's a nice card. And Ryan Fraser's doing no bad at the moment. So... So, yeah. We, we are going to take that walk. If I can find them. Where's the transfer targets? Right, here we go. Let's do this. Where are we? We're going to take the cheap one. Because we're cheap bastards. Right, here we go. Boom, boom. 34k. Gone. But we've got we've got Watkins, so what's his name? Ollie Watkins, I think he actually need to learn his first name. A bit disrespectful. This guy's like, you know, dragging me up the divisions here. And I, I don't even have the courtesy of knowing his name, but uh, we'll, we'll figure that out. We will figure that out. Right, let's get into this then. Play. Let's add him into the team. Where is he? Where is he? The man. We need him. Watkins. Where'd you go, son? So we're going to replace... We're actually replacing Watkins with Watkins, but let's be real. <laughs> Uh, we're, we're, they, they were gaining like 8 in terms of rating, so this is not like a <laughs> Watkins for Watkins swap. This is like different gravy, so he looks a wee bit retarded though in that picture, to be fair. Hopefully he doesn't play retarded, or I'll be, I'll be, he'll be getting quick sold. I'll be demanding my money back 100%. Right, but here we go. Let's do this. Uh, we've got Fraser, we've got Bailey. We're ready to get into it, then. Let's start the game. Like I said, we're on a winning streak. I want to keep that winning streak going. Uh, we're going to play in the Scotland kit. Why not? It would feel wrong not to. So, yeah, Scotland kit it is. Scotland kit all the way. And we are playing. This guy, he's got Jamie Fardy. He's got Lukaku. Salah. Manny. De Bruyne. Uh, it's a good team. Allison, Team of the season, Allison, Andy Robertson. He's called Welsh. So he's a sheep shagger. But he doesn't know he's about to get shagged by Super John again, so it's all good. It's all good. He was away there and we didn't find him. Now it's Cooper against him. Oh, good interception there for Kieran Tierney. Brilliant stuff. Got to love it. Don't love that though. Do not love that. It's a great save. Oh, it's another great save. Holy shit, and we've been tripped up the keeper. Oh, come on. I mean, I can't really fault the guy because he made two great saves, but. Has to stop that group for a corner, surely, man. That was. It's in the game. Oh, it's another brilliant. Martinez is the man. I'm telling you that. Martinez is the man. He's proven it here. Denying this guy. Brilliant. Here we go. Cash then wins it. Oh, no. And then Cash wins it, but then Cash loses it offside. Another interception. McGinn. Out to Caden. Right, here we go. Well, up to Fraser. Fraser finds Watkins. Watkins to McGinn. Oh, no, McGinn losing out there. McGinn, what are you doing, son? You're supposed to be the man in this team. And you're losing it like that. Right, Bannon. Bailey. It's back to Barry Bannon. Bannon out to Bailey. No, Bailey. Liam Bailey, man. What? That's two good chances we've had. Haven't taken any of them. Ball it to Fraser. Fraser. Here we go, Fraser, back to Caden. It's Watkins, it's through to Barry Bannon, and Barry Bannon falls on his ass. A typical Barry Bannon thing to do. Oh no, we've took him out, we've wiped him clean out. And the referee is going to run over here and show us the red card. And it's Kieran Tierney as well. The guy that we did not want to get a red card has just been given a red card. Block, Martinez is diving. I mean, he's not going to keep that one in. As good as he is, he's, he's no stopping that fair. Corner kick. Oh, it's somebody got a touch on that. I think it's it's been another corner given to them. That's good play. And that's 1-0. And that's what happens when you go down to 10 men. You get, you get punished. We've just been punished there big time. 
I should not. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't have got him sent off. I was a fucking idiot. I know that. It's going to be a long way back here. One nil down. A man down. And we will try our best though. What have we got left in the tank? Tell you what, the current gas price is not a fucking lot. But we'll see. Ball's played out to Salah. We need to track back. And again. Oh no, I'm again. Yes, we've got the head on that. Well, here we go. And it's referees giving. I mean, why would he give a free kick when on the counter? What a knob. I mean, he's, he's clearly done that just to fuck us up, man. Surely. John Fraser still got it. I mean, surely that's a foul. McGinn. Watkins. It's out to Barry Bannon. Bannon. Oh, man. That should be one one. That should be one each. That has to be one each. Fraser. Shite. Oh, come on, Watkins. And Watkins hits it right at the goalkeeper, man. Are you serious? How the fuck can we not take advantage? How can we not get a goal back? We've won it again. It's McGinn. It's Bailey. It's Watkins. Off the post. And offside. So close. But yet, yeah, so far. No, we get that. No, and it's another comfortable save by Martinez. Martinez in. Making back-to-back -back saves in a couple of minutes. McGinn. McGinn have tried to find Bailey. Bailey's got it here. Bailey, oh no, come on, Fraser! Puts it wide, are you shitting me? We should have upgraded Fraser, man. We should have brought in Coutinho, because that was pish. Has to score that, and he hasn't. 0-0 at the break. Or 1-0 at the break. Should be 1-H. Cannot believe Fraser put that past the post there. Right, here we go this time. Fraser, make up for your mistake. Silver. Brilliant. It's Bailey. Back into it. 1 1. Let's go. Fucking 10 men, no men. This guy's no beating us. Let's do it. So I've got 40, what, two minutes to get a winner. Oh, but Brilliant bought him again. Here we go. It's Barry Bannon. Fraser. No, it was shocking. Can we at least get a corner, please? Right, we do. Small consolation prize, but we'll, we'll take it. Gift wrapped. Can we open it? Let's find out. Silver ball into the box. It's not great. It's not great. Still not great. Oh, that's good, though. Oh, that's, that's no bad as well. That's pish, though. That is pish. And it's Silver! Go! That's no pish. That's great. It's 2-1. It is 2-1 in Division 5. We're doing the 10-men, but does it matter or not? It does not. Bernardo Silver blasting that in. Taking no prisoners. And you know what? We might actually bring on a centre-back now, considering I've just been playing with the one centre-back. I might make a change here. But then again, I might want to score another goal and put this game to bed. Decisions, decisions, decisions. We'll, we'll leave it for now. Nice turn for Bannon. Back to Cash. Watkins, oh Watkins, but he's... oh not Watkins, man, what are you doing? That's offside. I, had... I mean, that would have been Watkins' fault, one hundred percent there, one hundred percent. Watkins, Watkins, oh, it was a good shot, but it was an equally good save for the keeper. Bernardo, ball whipped in. Oh, it's falling for Watkins. Saved. And that should be a goal, 100%. Bailey strikes it. Hits about 10 million fucking white shots. And it doesn't go into the back of the net. And there's Robertson. Great challenge. Another great challenge for Cash. Oh, and it's a good tackle for McGinn. McGinn getting back. Now we can go on the attack. Now we can counter. John McGinn, ball it to Bailey. It's Watkins. It's Watkins. Oh, what? Penalty! Virgil van Dijk is completely clattered into him. The rest gave a penalty. He can't believe it. I can't believe it. And it's going to be... Surely it's going to be John McGinn to step up to try and score this one. Can John McGinn put it into the back of the net? He can! Super John! Scores, makes it 3-1, and this should be enough. And here we go, ball through to Watkins. Watkins is through. It is Watkins. And he puts it in the back of the net. I think it's Watkins' first goal for the club. It's 
It's all over. Oh, that's a good strike. It won't matter a shit, but it's a good strike. Lukaku pulls one back. And look, I'm actually celebrating. Not even Lukaku, it's Akin Fenwa. But yeah, whatever. It's 4-2 to us. That's all, that's all that matters. 4-2 with one. It's another victory. Don't know how many that is in a row. Look, like I said, losing count. John McGinn was the man of the match. For some reason, our player ratings are all very low. Not too sure why, so man of the match, goal, and it gets us an extra upgrade, which is good, plus we get to open a pack since we won, but yeah, no, I don't know why our player ratings were so low, I mean, considering we basically won that match with 10 men, Tierney got sent off very early, I cannot believe our ratings are that low, but anyway, John McGinn was the best player on our side, I'm assuming he was the best player overall, yeah, he was, but yeah, those player ratings, very, very low. I mean, we deserved that. I mean, we turned it around, didn't we, second half? He'd one shot in the second half, so... Yeah, when, when we needed to, when we needed to perform, we did. And, uh, yeah, there you can see now. So, is that four out of four wins? Not too sure, but we're looking good. A hybrid. We're going to open this one. Elect Electrum Players Pack. It's a hybrid pack with some golds and silvers in there. So, yeah, we'll open this. We'll see what we get. And what we get is German centre-back Bayern Munich... So, not bad, but uh, not exactly Bernardo Silva now, is it? Alright, so we're going to bring in Johnny Russell then. Like I said, I will put him on the left. And while it doesn't do a lot for his chemistry, if we switch him, Barry Bannon, around with uh, Bernardo Silva, it means that Silva's now playing on a 10, while Bannon's playing on a 9. Johnny Russell's still on a 3, which is a little bit worrying, but... It's not a lot else we can do. Yeah, so it's about as good as it's going to get, to be honest with you. Um, until we maybe bring in Coutinho, and if we bring in Coutinho, then we can switch Johnny Russell back to right wing. But for now, that's going to do it. We also need to take Tierney out, which is a shame. But he's going to have to come out for one game and serve that suspension. So we will bring out Tierney and we'll put in... It's going to be Mings, isn't it? It has to be Mings. So Mings coming in. And that is it then. There you go, 94 chemistry. Let's get to the next game. Let's see if we can make it five wins for five. Apparently it was only four wins in a row I've done, but it seems like a lot more than that. There you go, decent team. Benzema up front. He's got Van Dijk and Raphael Farran at the back. But I'm sure I will I'll torture those guys with, with the new signing Watkins and, of course, Johnny Russell. Oh, Jesus Christ, how lucky is that? And Benzema smashes it up the post, and the post plays a 1-2 to him. Then he gets the rebound, unbelievable. McGinn. Super John again. oh, he's trying to find, I don't know, oh, that's a free kick, man, that's a foul, but of course, don't give it to us. Why would you give it to us? Never do. That's a foul. He actually does blow his whistle. Is he going to give him a card? No, he's not. Who can take this? Let's see, who can we take this? Bernardo Silver. Very solid at free kicks. It might be Bernardo Silva then. Tell you what, with that 96 accuracy, of course it's going to be Bernardo Silva. There we go, Bernardo Silva. That's, that's shocking. That's horrendous. Got it back. It's Mings. To Russell. It's Johnny Russell. Brilliant solo goal by Johnny Russell. And he's proven that it doesn't matter if he plays out of position. He can play fucking anywhere. And he'll score the goals. Brilliant. It's Barry Bannon. Bannon. Oh, that's too easy. It's too easy. I mean, the Scots boys, isn't it? People saying they ain't good enough. Barry Bannon and John, Johnny Russell, man. Looking fantastic. So could Johnny Russell get his second goal of the game? He can. And he's absolutely stuck at top bins. What a strike that is. And we are all over this guy. This guy cannot live with us. McGinn. The Caden McGinn gets wiped out. He's going to get back on his feet though. And it's going to be a chance for John McGinn. Oh no, it's not quite. The keeper makes a save and denies us. Still Silver. Silver to Watkins. We've got McGinn running in there. He's going to try and look for Russell though. Johnny Russell. Oh, brilliant for Russell. Going to get the hat trick and he does. Slides it underneath the goalkeeper. It's 4-1. We had Johnny Russell hat trick. 
And there we, we're actually doubting bringing in Johnny Russell. Well, doubt no more. But oh no, I think we may just be getting... And it's another straight... For the second consecutive game, we've got a man sent off. And it's so fucking stupid. Didn't need to do that. I mean, we're winning 4-1. I don't think it's going to come back to haunt us, but... Good save by Martinez. It's, it's going to play it up. No, we're not. Yes, we are. Johnny Russell then comes short. Ball played up to Johnny Russell. And this is another chance. It's Johnny Russell. Oh, he's, he's fell on his arse. Oh, Johnny Russell. What a mistake. He's forced off the defender there. Surprised this guy hasn't raged quite yet. We are pummeling him. Not the greatest corner. And he's going to look to get out of it, but... Can Bernardo Silva chase him back? He can. And that will be Coopers all day long. Oh, and Cash has been brought down there, but the referee... I think he's just going to go straight to half-time then. I mean, 4-1 at the break. You, you really can't argue with that, can you? You lost... Oh, my God, you bet. <gasps> That's giving me a defeat. Where for fuck right off, man, really? Right, shitey internet just fucking screwed me out of an easy win there. Four one up at half time. Internet decides it can't take it anymore. It gives up, and I I've been given a DNF. You didn't finish your match, really. Four one up, mate. Incomplete control. Even though I had ten men, guy couldn't lay a finger on me. But it's going to give me a DNF. I mean, come on, the fuck seriously. If you're four one up and your internet disconnects, you should get the win. I'm not. I'm not having it. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna count that as a loss. No, no way. I was winning, winning easily. So, I mean, it is what it is. I don't know if John McGinn got any upgrades. I don't know if he got any assists. There's no way to tell that. But what I will do is, I'm going to open my pack. So we'll, we'll open my pack and we'll see. We'll see what we get. But uh, yeah, very, very annoying because that's our winning streak. Then comes to an end, and it, through no fault of my own. It's not my fault Fudge and Media have shite internet, is it? No, definitely not. Uh, it's going to be Sen Senegal. It's, it's a good guy. Right, well, that's it. We'll get straight into the next game then. I mean, Johnny Russell, what a start. I don't even know. Will those goals even count for Johnny Russell? Is there any way to check that? I mean, Johnny Russell scores what, a hat trick on his debut? No, so what a fucking disgrace. Johnny Russell with a hat trick in his debut, but the goals won't count. That is absolutely sickening. Very sickening. But in terms of um, games played, you can see that Bernardo Silva and McGinn have played 32 each, and McGinn has 11 goals more than Silva and 7 assists more than Silva. So that's pretty interesting. If you look at goals, man, it is mainly, the goals do mainly come from McGinn and Bernardo Silver, although Danny Ings had a really good record. Nine goals in eight games. Um, looking at the rest of these guys, so records aren't as good. Uh, but yeah, we can fix that going forward. Let's not worry about it. But Johnny Russell, they are, I feel bad for the guy. I mean, he scores a hat trick in the first half, and the goals essentially get chopped off because of shitey internet. You know, it's, it's no right. But yeah, let's get into the next game. And it's actually gave me a defeat, so yeah, I mean, that's, that's that's an absolute joke. It's actually moved me back on the ladder to Division 4 as well. What a bummer, right? Well, let's just not let it affect us. Let's just make sure we win this next match. Or else I will be pissed to we get back-to-back -back defeats, and one of them wasn't even, wasn't even me losing. Right, let's do this. Here we go. Waiting for a sign of good internet. You'll be waiting a long fucking time, I tell you that, man. If you're waiting on good internet, you'll be here all night. Actually, he probably won't be here because you'll get disconnected. But well, there you go. We've got Ronaldo up front. We have some black guy in a Liverpool shirt. I'm assuming it's Origi. It could be Origi. I don't know. Um, it's got another guy in a Liverpool shirt. Did I keep Mings in instead of... I did, yeah. So I've actually kept Mings in the team instead of bringing in Tierney, which was a mistake by me. But hopefully it won't, won't really cost as much as Bailey. Coming inside, ba oh, Bailey, that's probably Philly on Bailey. And just like that, it's 1-0, that was very easy there. As we dribbled around the entire defence. Poor wee Alfie, not getting off to a good start, is he? Barry Bannon, oh, to Russell. Can Russell get a goal now? He got denied last time, it's Russell, brilliant. Johnny Russell there, 
gets a goal, and we're two 0 up in seven minutes. And that, there should be six wins in a row, but the fucking shit internet has screwed me. Time and time again, I lose games because this internet. I mean, I can understand it if you were fucking stealing somebody's Wi-Fi caravan internet, but come on to Christ. Paying good money for this shit. Johnny Russell, shot blocked. Turns, still to Johnny Russell, brilliant, 3-0. 3-0 in under 10 minutes. Are we going to get a rage quit? No, he's going to soldier on. Here we go. McGinn still running. Oh, brilliant. Nah, he's onside. Don't even think about saying he's half. McGinn trying to chip him. McGinn gets a rebound. McGinn makes it four. This guy is paused. This guy is about to rage quit 100%. He's had it off. He can't take it. Look at that. You've lost connection to your opponent. This time, we lose connection the right way. We him quitting like a bitch for other than me getting disconnected. But let's see. In terms of player ratings... Who, Jory Russell got man of the match with two goals, what you expect. McGinn got a, a goal, but that's all he got. So, no upgrades, which kind of sucks, but I'm sure if that match had finished, we would have definitely got an upgrade or two, because, I mean, look at the amount of goals we were scoring. We were banging them in for fun, but, uh, nah, we were, you know, pretty much cheated at that. It should be six wins in a row, you know. We should be halfway to Division 4, but, again, the, uh, the internet... We all, we all know the story by now. I'm not going to complain, not going to cry. But the internet did fucking screw us over there big time. I guess we'll just open this. 75 rated player. And it's Lo Celso from Villarreal who will not be getting into the team. Not a bad player, but certainly not better than Bernardo Silva. Right, so <laughs> don't appear to be able to get an opponent. For some reason, the I don't know if the servers are down, but they're they're not matching up to an opponent. That's twice through the timers expired. Uh, yeah, we can't seem to get a player, so that's how we're going to end it, guys. Yeah, not a lackluster finish, but I mean it is what it is. I never lost this game episode, so again cheated. Uh, we'll be back next time. <laughs> again, oh, yeah, not a lot I can do. I mean, I tried, can't can't find anybody to play against. They're all running scared, so. We'll just have to wait and see, guys. Next time we'll be back. Hopefully we can keep on winning and we'll hopefully get to Division 4. Anyway, guys, that's it. Till next time. If you like, subscribe, comment down below. Shite internet, shite EA, shite connections, shite everything. But what's no shite is our team. Our team's looking pretty good. And it will be, in my opinion, sooner or later in Division 4 and hopefully even higher. But until then, peace.